Well, what a stretch we have had of weather, and it's been incredibly dry in southeastern Wisconsin. The streak of 80s came to an end Wednesday when we had a high of 73. Yesterday, 76 degrees, stuck in the 70s today as well. But a lot of showers and a couple thunderstorms are moving through southeastern Wisconsin, all a part of an occluded front. That means the cold front is caught up to the warm front, so these are a little bit elevated, definitely bringing some rain and much needed rain to southeastern Wisconsin. Those will become much more isolated or isolated to scattered as we get into the afternoon and evening hours coming to an end by about midnight. And then skies are going to be uh, staying mostly cloudy as we go throughout your Saturday. Could have some patchy fog to kick off the day and an isolated sprinkle or shower possible on Saturday, but that will be your driest day out of the weekend. Here comes another storm system to bring better chances for rain on Sunday. As that warm front gets closer to us, it'll bring a good chance for some more widespread rain showers on Sunday and into Sunday night. So far in August, over a quarter of an inch low on rain, and that brings us up to about six and a quarter of an inch low so far this year. So the drought monitor showing abnormally dry conditions for portions of Fond du Lac and Sheboygan County here in Milwaukee since July over two inches low on the rainfall. So again, becoming much more hit and miss as we go throughout the afternoon and evening hours. As far as the rain showers go, the heaviest rain totals are going to be north of I-94. Here's a look at one computer model showing generally about a quarter of an inch in portions of Ozaki, Washington and Dodge County, closer to a half an inch up in Fond du Lac and Sheboygan County to right around a tenth of an inch along 94 and less than a tenth of an inch of rain expected in the gauge south of 94. So hopefully you'll get some of those rain showers, much needed rain showers as we go into Sunday. Today though, can hit and miss showers 78 degrees with some more clouds and a bit more in terms of humidity. The added moisture going to lead to some patchy fog overnight tonight. 66 year overnight low with showers coming to an end by about midnight. And then as we go into your weekend, we are talking about Saturday being the drier day out of the weekend. And if you're headed up to Green Bay for a family night for the Packers game, 76 Six degrees for tailgating, mostly cloudy, and 78 by 5 p.m. and 71 by 9 p.m. If you're sticking around southeastern Wisconsin, 80 degrees on Saturday with mostly cloudy skies again, some morning patchy fog. An isolated shower is possible. And if you're traveling across the state, 84 with mostly cloudy skies in Madison. If you're looking at Sunday, 77 degrees, and it will be a day with a good chance for some showers and a few thunderstorms, a lot more 70s across the Badger State. Your seven day forecast showing less humidity after those showers and thunderstorms. Chances on Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday looking at cooler and more comfortable.